this week also, there was an article for um, the podcaster. Oh, Andrew, Andrew uh, Huberman. Huberman. I mean, mm-hmm. and now there's an article that says that he was having multiple girlfriends, having multiple relationships. You know, I, I briefly read over the article, but the reality is like, who, like, who are we idolizing? I mean, I, I met him. I consume his content, solid content. The guy delivers a lot of information. Mm. He's responsible of helping a lot of young men or, or men stop drinking, sleep better, eat better. He never claimed to be like this relationship guru. He never claimed mm. to have it all together. Like I think that we're trying to look for perfection. And I think perfection is the lower standard. Now, again, I'm not, I'm not, uh, there's two different conversations. One is Pediri's criminal charges that may be brought, brought to him. The other one is human. There's an article about his ex-girlfriends talking about his his past lives. Mm. At the end, nobody is going to um, get away nowadays from doing something that you don't want brought into light. And it's true. I mean, I think, you know, he I don't know much about him. I've heard a couple of podcasts because he has a lot of people that bring so much knowledge. And I think like, you know, he, he's a scientist, so he's a person that like he has to prove something. So he's going to show you the way that it's done. And I think he's done such a beautiful job, especially when I listen to him. Like the science sometimes is just like way over my head. Some stuff that's like so um, profound and he makes it so simple. So I think he's a genius at doing that stuff. But it's like, you know, we come into this podcast and we're talking about God, money and sex because those are the the things that like we always have a challenge with. And, and we say sex, but we're talking about relationships all the time. It's like, not just him, but everyone in this world, like we have a challenge with relationships and the way that he shows up in his business and his podcast is not going to be the same way that he shows up in his relationships. And, you know, we see that again and again and again. Because we're not perfect. We're not. Because like, see, see, the, the situation here is that we're looking for somebody to show us the path, to show us the way. Perfection is the lower standards. Instead yeah. of looking for the good things from this guy, the good things, and then I'm going to make my own decision and I'm going to make my own uh, uh, formula right. because nobody has a formula. That's why I was telling even my clients, so don't analyze me. Don't put me up here. Like I am the farthest guy from perfection. I'm you're still in, messenger. I'm, I'm, I'm still in the progress stage, right? Yeah. So because the yeah. moment that you think you're perfect, the moment that you think you arrive, yeah. it's just a matter of time that you fall down. I think that's what happened to, to P. Diddy. He thought he arrived he could do all this crazy shit that now no, he's getting no, he's no, getting no. in trouble I, for. I think we did is just like you know like, you just go down this rabbit hole of like you know we talked about this all the time like that lust like you satiating yourself it's like you try something so many times then you have to start opening other doors mm-hmm. and then when you open them they're like there's no turning back and i think like this people get into that place where it's like I have done, I've opened so many doors. I, I don't everything. even know like yeah. which one I want to do or not want to do. It's not enough. It's like a Pandora's box, right? It's like when you open that box, it's like, it's crazy. If you like this video, click here to watch the entire podcast. And if you want to watch any of the other previous God Money Six podcasts, click here.